As Morph is a transition between slides, sometimes you need an additional slide purely to achieve the effect you want during the transition. For example, this sequence has a slight zoom effect on the hallway image, which also darkens, and photo text pans down through a patterned image. In edit mode, the second slide is what you want, but to achieve the effect of everything moving and changing, you need to have a setup or transition slide to start with, which then allows the morph transition to do its job. Adding in extra slides to a presentation can be problematic, as you don't want to run the risk of the presenter getting lost or having to remember to click just to move to the next slide. Instead, if you need these transition slides, go to the Transitions tab on the ribbon, and over on the right-hand side you'll see options to advance slide. Typically, you want a mouse click, giving you control, but in this instance, select the After box and choose 0 seconds. This means that when in slideshow mode, PowerPoint will automatically and immediately transition to the next slide, giving you the effect that you want. It can be used for simple effects or more complex ones, but it's always useful to think about. Just remind any users of the deck not to remove these slides. Although they're not useful for content as such, they are vital to achieve the design or storytelling technique that you want.